Okay, hi guys. Today I'm gonna show you one thing which is very important uh, for a small and startup uh, business. Okay, this one is the income statement for small business. Uh, you guys may ask um, why we should have uh, the income statement for business because my business is very small. Um, you know why? Because like we should understand your current business situation, which is like you really earn the profit or you uh, honestly like um, you cannot eat enough. Uh, your profit not enough to cover your expenses and this will be uh, the alert for your business um, maybe you should reduce the cost or you need to adjust your price okay and um, like for six months the first the first six months and one year um, you cannot uh, expecting like um, uh, you gonna generate a loss of uh, profit uh, what we need to expecting is um, to balance and survival our business um so uh, that's why um the income statement very important uh, and i already make for you one ready template and what you have to do you just need to fill in all the information and it will show you all um the information you need to balance your business okay um so now i gonna show you how to use the template and where it is located okay actually i already um, uh, uploaded in the google drive and you just need to come there to download it and use only this okay so right now just um, come to the template and i'm gonna show you how to use it mm, okay okay firstly you will see um this uh, this first sheet which is like um like your report uh, okay i can bring here just like um your income report okay income report so um okay just um okay i gonna adjust this later um this one just like um the income report uh, first one but uh, actually you can see here we have months which is september october november and december which is like the last quarters of the year okay so in these pages um you don't have to uh type everything because it will be automatically generated from another sheet okay so what you have to do you just need to add in all the amount in the bubble colors which is i already um highlight the color here and um, and even here uh, i already mentioned very details like uh, please fill in the number in the bubble columns okay so which one is the bubble you need to fill it in and which one is not bubble please don't touch it okay or if you want to adjust please adjust it but um, basically this extra sheet i already meant uh, i already like uh, make it uh, very detailed for you so just need to follow the instruction okay so firstly you can see the gross revenue um here i write it that uh, which it is is like the sale price um multiply with quantities um so for example like um, think, um yeah uh like normally I'm, I'm selling one candles which is the price like 14 um dollars so if i'm still 100 um my revenue total in a month which is 1400 dollars okay and here this one you need to add in your total revenue okay whatever your revenue just add here and and don't touch in the red one i mean the, this one the orange one don't touch this okay and um so you need to add in the cost for example for me i need uh soy wax um and like um so many kind of like wigs soy wax uh, and the container everything so i need to add in the material so for example my materials like twenty dollars um no total but i mean maybe like okay just add like um, ten dollars for materials okay and and only i also like have um i think you need to do like four hundred dollars okay i should add like four hundred dollars and maybe monthly i have the hosting rent uh, you see this one these these things 
um, you can do the adjustment because like maybe for example I do have the hosting which is like $29 monthly so I need to uh, put in $29 and then maybe I also uh, need to use like um, water electric whatever if I have uh, if you have the office and you need to spend for this please, uh, please add in for example $20 and for office suppliers for example like um, I think mostly for the small business we need to have some kind of like uh, the wrapping papers um, and decoration and stickers for example because we need to give free gift for the clients but I gotta add in like also 20 and legal cost if you do have any taxes please add in maybe $20 monthly maybe because I don't know how much for yours and even right now what I'm doing just they, they move for this it's not really real cost of me okay I have so much expenses and costs for example, you do the Google ad or Facebook ad or whatever ad you do, and you should add in, for example, fifty dollars. And for the payrolls, for example, like um, if you do have the the staff to work under you, you should add the payrolls. But if you don't have it, just delete it. Um, or you just add like, for example, transportation. Um, trans, uh, transportation, for example. And uh, you have any transportation like you need delivery or you need to pay for the transportation so organization for example some additional cost you should add in here okay and so see um here you can see uh we do have material cost and we also have here uh, i I classify is uh, material cost and operating cost um, because you know um, we need to know exactly how much for the materials we are using right and for operating cost which is something uh, which is not really directly to um to to our cost which is like for example a like management cost for example like you can see like the hosting rent is really not directly to the material cost of us for the products but actually if without this we cannot generate um, the product to sell for a client so um, these things mm, because this one is not really like financial cost this one I just want to make everything very comprehensive very like um, brief I briefed I mean it's like something very uh, very much uh, fast and quick and small things so you can directly apply to your business so um, so you just need to know we normally we do have to have like direct costs and indirect costs and materials things the thing we need to care because this is directly to make um, for your product so what, whatever your products you make by yourself so you need to have this cost and the second thing is which is like um, those something indirectly so we um, will we make it here so you can see you just need to add everything in the bubbles and it directly calculate everything for you and you can see you will have like total direct cost how much and you also have like total operating cost how much okay so you can see here like the formulas and, and by the formulas you can understand um, how it work um so basically this excel excel sheet is very easy to use um because what we need to care we need to care the gross revenue which is the total one and the cost of the goods sold which is like the, co the our expenses to have this product and in the end we need to know the net revenues of us like after we minus everything after we deducted everything what is the balance we got this is our real products okay because like if you just say i sold one thousand five hundred dollars they just gross uh, gross revenues it's not it's not your profit because f how you can have uh, because you need to generate it after minus the cost okay mm, okay so here i also have the percentage um in this percentage um you can see like um the net profit um, here you can see like um, uh, the cost of goods sold which is like the percentage of total revenue um, uh, like how much your cost for example right now is my cost in total revenues which is like 39 percent okay it's fine because as long because for me as long I am not rich to 45 percent 
and my um, my business still good because I allow myself to, um, allow my business to cost until 45% okay it's still less than 5% um, to, to reach um, the highest level because right now what I want I just want to my business survival so the cost a little bit high 45% because normally it should be around 20 to 25 um, so you can generate the good profit but right now it's still very high and sometimes some month it can climb to uh, 60% okay it's fine for me 60% until it's not really uh, reach to 75% if it reach to 75% it means like I should look back to my cost and I should look back to the price okay um, so you understand how to use this right uh, okay so when you look at um, this percentage, like net revenue, if your revenue is still around like 50 50, okay, find a problem for the small business and in the, the, the stay up startup, okay? So this one is very good. Um, okay, so now um, because monthly you should have it. It's not just like one month you have income statement and another month you don't have because, like, in the end of the year, you not really know what gonna happen so this one I make for the last quarterly um, so you should update like monthly okay so now come back to the first one after you already have monthly so you will have the yearly it would be direct uh, directly to update in this sheet so um, what you have to do you just need to uh, fill it in all the bubble color okay for this one is the note you can check the note and do by instruction just add in the bubble colors and it will directly calculate for you and you can see here um you can check as well how is your revenue for example uh, this one is just a demo and by this you can see like um, the net revenue for the month of september uh, which is uh, very low um, but in the October is higher and uh, November higher and December higher this one I just make the demo for you so if any ditches are changes this one also changes so by this one you understand where you are and what you have to do because like every small business even small or big business we need to have some kind of like recording to setting up your business plan um, so um, just have a look quickly on my website so this is um, the website and uh, any business you're doing you should have a website as well so in the next video I'm gonna show you what is the most important things you need to do when you set up your business okay and this is the link um, you gotta download this and just use it so I gonna uh, write down in below the link okay for you and you just come and download it and and just let me know if you have any issues uh, for um, for the excel sheet i don't have uh, i mean so like i'm not put any um block for the formulas because maybe you need to adjustment something for example um here you can adjustment something here like maybe some uh, some of you you don't have transportation so i mean it's like maybe you have more than the operating cost you can add in just right click okay just right click and insert the columns and uh, just write down and in this case you need to adjust a little bit here okay maybe you need to zoom zoom in one more column okay and if you have any problem i mean it's like for using the excel sheet or you need something else specific for yours i'm very happy to have you out i will make one special like that um excel sheet for you no worry because this one is just um, they can you can say this like um financial um modeling financial modeling um, So thank you so much. Um, thank you so much uh, for watching and have a nice day. And please comment below for me if you feel this very helpful and whatever you want, just tell me because I have experiences on startup like two business and 
I also failed several times and also built up so, so many things. So, um, have a nice day and see you next time. And thank you again. Bye.